To begin the guacamole exercise, spiral out with the leg as high up as you can, then bend your knee, take it back to the center line, and back down. Spiral out until you can't go any higher with a straight leg, bend the knee, take it back down. Warm that hip up. It's like building a fire, not turning on a light switch. Once you've got that hip warmed up, spiral out and in. And then what you do is you cross the center line and straighten out the leg. You'll feel a big expansion through the side body and through the hip, especially maybe the IT band if you're tight. But here's where you use your inhale to expand that area with your breath and bring more motion, healthy, sustainable motion, to an area that might be tight. You slide that road, spiral it back down the inside of that leg and then you repeat the process. Again, you're trying to move with as much ease as possible. So when you have the opportunity to let your leg rests, rest on the other leg, do so. Your hips have their own weight. They'll help pull you over. Spiral out, bend the knee, cross the center line. Now once you've done that a couple times, reverse the spiral. So reverse the whole process. So now I'm going out and in from the top and then crossing the center line. So I've just maximized the range, going through as big a range as I can with ease, really smoothing out and opening up the hips. What you're trying to develop is an awareness, an overall awareness of your body's mobility. And as your awareness develops and grows, you begin to recognize that you can have a significant amount of influence over your body's ability to perform well. So if things aren't working well, if things are choppy or hard or stiff or whatever, by going through these real fundamental exercises with ease, you can begin to develop a form of communication with your body that when your body's feeling tight, it'll tell you, and then you'll have the tools and the techniques to do something about it. The very main tool, the number one tool in core spiral wellness is breathing. And that's what I'm doing right here. I'm again, I'm expanding into the uh, for into the right side of my body. And so I'm stretching on the outside, but I'm moving also from the inside with my breath. That's essential. That's why the first principle of core spiral wellness is breathing. It's because once you figure out how to use your breath, it becomes one of the most effective tools that you'll have in your toolbox for maintaining your body's wellness and mobility. Uh, what I'm coming up to here is what I call knee flops and all that is is I've let all the tension out of my knees and I start to generate momentum back and forth to let my knees just flop back and forth. I mean if you could if you could see an x-ray of my body you'd see just how much motion I'm bringing through my hips with ease. That's the key, with ease. So that's guacamole.